Welcome to this video. I have a very, very exciting video for you today. My name is Kevin Barnes. If this is your first time watching my videos, make sure you like, share, subscribe. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create your own AI character. Now, you may be asking, why would I want to create my own AI character? First of all, the future of business is here. Artificial intelligence is getting ready to change business, online business, how brands do business with people. It's getting ready to change. Now, Brands no longer have to go and find and pay an influencer to model or use their clothing. Now you can create an artificial intelligence character for brands to be able to use for their campaigns. Now, you can do that. I mean, you can start a OnlyFans. If you want to start a OnlyFans and have your own explicit images of females inside of there and charge a monthly subscription, you can do that. You can create a spokesperson for your online business. If you don't want to show your face, you can create cash cow YouTube channels where you don't have to show your face at all. You can just show your character's face. And there's ways that you can animate it so the character talks. Look, business is getting freaky at this point. And those that do not stay on top of, um, of technology, you will get left behind. So let me, I'm going to show you the basics of creating a AI character. Now I'm going to be using Leonardo AI. Now, first, what you want to do is you want to sign up for a Leonardo.ai account. After you sign up for a Leonardo account, they're going to send you a link to your email. You click the link in your email and then you're able to get right here. Now, there's a lot of things that you're able to do. I won't go through every single thing that you can do here. But what I will do is I'll show you how to create a basic character. Now, these services, there's millions of different services that you can use. In this video, I'm only talking about Leonardo AI. But just for those that's asking, well, how much is it? Everything is free, but all you're paying for is credits. Now, it costs, well, for this character that I'm creating, it costs 26 credits. I don't know why it costs 26 credits, but a lot of these different services they cost, you know, four to five to maybe six credits to create an image. So if you want to buy more credits, you can always buy more credits. But now this is a secret. Well, it's not a secret. But if you want to use multiple Leonardo AI accounts for free, don't tell anybody I told you. Sign up for multiple accounts and use different emails. That way you get 150 new credits every single day and you never have to pay for it. Don't tell them I told you that, though. Don't tell them I told you. That didn't come from me, you know? So what you want to do after you've logged in, you have all of your stuff set up, you know, and I'm not going to go through every single function. Like I said, I'm just going to show you how to create a basic image. Now, you click image generation. Once you click image generation, you want to make sure photo reel is on. Um, I'm able to create up to four images. And um, let me see, there's a lot of other things that you can do. You can change the resolution here. You can change, you know, the input dimensions. You can also change, um, where is it at? Let me see, you can also, okay, so you can also change if you want this to be for Instagram, if you want this to be, like whatever you want this to be for, the aspect ratio, you can change all of these things. But for right now, we're just gonna create a basic image. Now. Here, now there's two ways that you can do this. You can go to ChatGPT and you can input these words or something like this, whatever it is that you want to create, which is called a prompt. Now, a prompt is a set of instructions which tells Leonardo AI exactly what it is that you want to create. Now, if you go to ChatGPT, ChatGPT will allow you to have a more realistic, detailed prompt and it'll help you be able to get a lot closer to the type of image that you want to create. But since I'm not going to do any of that right now, I'm not going to go to ChatGPT. I'm just going to show you how simple this is. So I'm going to create photography of a, let me see, black woman, fit, green eyes, long brown curly hair. She's standing in the rainforest. Uh, she's standing in the rainforest with a bathing suit on um let me see we're gonna do full body shot realistic photo it's midday 
Um, but getting ready to rain soon. Okay, so we won't have the getting ready to rain soon. And what I did was is here's what you want to do. You want to first of all get the face down. Now I didn't get really too detailed with the face. You know, I just literally just I'm just putting this in here so it's not a long video. After you get the face taken care of, then you want to get the body taken care of. After you get the body taken care of, then you want to get the scenery. What is she standing in front of? You know, then you want you. You can also be able to put the time of day in here. You can also put lenses and cameras, right? I actually went and Googled a top quality camera and I put the lens in here just to see what it's going to look like. Now, I'm going to have her in the rainforest with a bathing suit on um, with a uh, tiger in the background now sometimes these things don't generate ex every single detail so you have to sometimes generate these over and over but as you can see this is going to generate 26 tokens now i normally get 150 new ones every day like i said if you want to have multiple of these accounts you can always change the email and do the same thing but i'm going to generate this and then we're going to scroll down and we're going to see exactly what this generates. As you can see, it's going to generate me four different images. And we're going to see exactly what this is going to do. Now, if this does not come out right, there's also a section here. Let me see. Well, that's not on this one. That's not on this one. But they also have... You know, sometimes they have, you know, your image may come out with deformed fingers or, you know, or the face might look weird or something, you know. So they have a section in here where you can input the negative, you know, aspects that you don't want. You know, now look at this. I told them to photography of a black woman, fit green eyes, long brown curly hair. She's standing in the rainforest with a bathing suit on. She doesn't have a bathing suit on with a tiger in the background, full body shot realistic photo it's midday and i have the camera and lens now there is no tiger in the background so they didn't fully generate everything that i wanted them to generate but they definitely created me a young lady with green eyes i think her eyes are green i mean that's what it looks like right but as you can see look how realistic this looks this looks realistic i can literally download this upload this to a or i can download it i can go to another service or another free tool that i'm going to show you on another video create a bunch of different images and use her face for every single image and then take those images and put it on an instagram account and promote that i am a model or she's a model and she's open for brand deals there's all types of things that you can do here with this, right? So now that we've created that, you can go and you can see, like, you know, you can get as creative as you want with this, right? So let me go back here and let me go back to image generation. You can get creative as you want. Now, let's say I wanted a black man. Now, I'm going to say muscular muscular uh we're gonna say dread dreadlocks uh we're gonna say green eyes uh we're not gonna do this uh we're not gonna do this and they did she didn't have a bathing suit on standing in front of a grocery store Standing in front of the grocery store, we're going to take the tiger out because they didn't put that anyway. Standing in front of a grocery store, and I'm just generating different images just so you can see what's possible. So you generate this, and then we wait to see. Now, what I would suggest being a beginner, I would suggest you go to chat GPT first. Go to ChatGPT, write there exactly what you're trying to create. And after you write there what it is that you're trying to create, copy that prompt 
and then come here and put it inside of Leonardo AI. The reason is, is because ChatGPT is going to get more specific. They're going to be able to describe more details. And the more detailed this, now look at this. This is crazy, right? Look at this. Did it not create exactly what I wanted it to create? And he looks 100% real. You guys, business is changing right in front of our eyes. So you are either going to get with it or you are going to get left behind. Now, this is a nice image that I'm actually, I'm going to save this because this can be used as another model that I'm going to create for what I'm doing. So I didn't mean to make this video long. I am going to show you more about AI as we continue to create more videos. Make sure that you like, share, subscribe. I suggest you go to Leonardo.ai. Practice, have some fun, um, you know, because there's ways that you can automate this and make him talk. There's all different types of things, and I'm going to be showing you all of those things on this channel. So if you're interested in seeing that, make sure you like, share, subscribe. I'll see you on the next video. Peace.